Bis. So I finally got a new video editing system, so there won't be any watermarks anymore. Yes, I am aware that the other one had watermarks. I wasn't going to pay $50 after I really like tirelessly edited this video and then all of a sudden come to find out my hard work went to waste. So I just uploaded it anyway. Anyway, today I wanted to do a video that I've been wanting to do for maybe like a month and a half when I first bought this product. And yeah, so this is going to be like a makeup-y kind of review thing. Yeah, I bought it off of eBay. And I've seen quite a few reviews for different types of the same thing. It's not the same exact product, but you know, on eBay, sometimes you never know what you're going to get. And now, just a disclaimer, I was not paid to say this. I was not sent the product for review. I bought the product myself and I just wanted to give an honest opinion on it. I pinky pinky promise that I will never ever sell out because somebody wants me to review their product and they give me money because I value my morals more than I do things. So now that that's all out of the way, I just wanted to show you this makeup brush kit that I have. And it is a 24 piece, and yes, it is pink. I don't really much care for pink, but you know, what is. Now the seller that I bought it from, they sold a 24 piece and a 32 piece, but I don't think I need 32 brushes because I don't really know what half of them are for. <laughs> but you know, I wanted something more professional than what I had because it was like scattered makeup brushes that were from like dollar store and makeup kits that people bought me over the years and they were not holding up very well. Now since there are 24 pieces here, I am not going to go through each and every one of them. Uh, I'm just going to kind of bulk them together and explain, you know, how they are. Kinda. Now then, I'm gonna show you my favorite brush because it's the best and it's, yeah. This fan brush is amazing, by the way. And it helps me just put on a little bit of powder foundation over my concealer and my primer so that way I get like the shine off without having to put too much on and whatever. Anyway, be forewarned that the seller did just put up recently that these are real animal fur. Uh, if you are one of those people who don't really appreciate that kind of stuff, I know there's a lot of you out there. Um, so if you really don't want animal hair, then yeah, it's, this isn't the product for you. Um, personally, I wouldn't buy it if I could help it, but I really thought it said synthetic when I bought it and then surprise a few weeks later they changed it to real animal fur so great now then um after we got past that and whatnot I do have to say this feels absolutely lovely on my skin I did see some reviews on YouTube not about the same product but about ones that looked ridiculously similar and they said that the product felt like straw on their face and it felt horrible. I'm here to say that this set that I bought feels amazing. It's just nice and soft and it's wonderful and I love it so much. And what it comes with is um, a fan brush, obviously, and then it comes with just a regular powder brush, a contour brush, and then a little brush. I don't know what this is for. Is it for like highlighting maybe? I am not a makeup brush expert, so I have no idea. And those are the three main brushes that it has. Then it has five different um, concealer brushes. I think these are all concealer brushes, just different sizes. Like I said, I'm not a makeup expert, so I'm sorry if I'm wrong. But yeah, I mean, they work very well. Um, I know for a fact this one is a concealer brush. I know it is. So um, it works very well for like patting down in these areas so you can kind of cover up the dark spots that you might have or the bags. These are fantastic. Then it comes with this little tiny fan brush and I think this one is actually for like highlighting and stuff but I don't ever use this because I suck at contouring and highlighting. 
And then it, of course, of course, almost every single makeup brush kit has this. It comes with this little thing, and if you don't know what it is, then Google it. I'm just kidding, you don't have to, I'm not like that mean, I promise. But as far as I know, this is just for like eyebrow grooming, and it could be used for eyelash. Like, I know a lot of people use this little area to get the clumps out of their eyelashes, I guess. I don't know what this is all used for. And then it comes with various sizes of, um, like, brushes and sponges for your eyeshadow. And I have to say that these are pretty decent, like the, the ones that are a little bit flatter are good for packing on eyeshadows. I don't like sponges so I don't use them very often, but this is my favorite one for the um, eyeshadows. And I don't even know if this is actually an eyeshadow brush, but I use it that way. It is literally circular all the way around and it um, it is very good for getting that little area right here because usually I put lighter color on my lid and in the corners and then I put a darker color here and then I just blend the crap out of it so it looks good but anyway this is great for getting this little area right there it really is it's fantastic and it comes with a couple of lip brushes which I use them and they're very nice they really are nice um, because I am horrible at doing actual lipstick so I have to like you know, get the lipstick on the brush and kind of sculpt my lips out. I don't know, maybe my lips are just weird. And then it comes with, I think this one is a um, eyeliner brush. Like, you know, you dip it in the gel pot and you just fancily put it on, which I am horrible at. And if you've seen any of my videos, I think I've mentioned in a couple of them, I use a gel pen one. So yeah, I don't use that one very often. And then the very last brush that I have in this little kit is just a mascara wand. I don't actually use this for mascara. I use it for afterward when I need to get the clumps out. I just kind of run it through. It helps to um, move the product around and such and it helps to just get the clumps out. It's like brushing your hair, you know, with a little tiny brush, but you know, you're brushing your eyelashes and whatever, you know, whatever. Actually, I was very happy I bought this set. And with it comes just a little case. It is faux leather. It is not real, obviously, because I only got this for $10, and that would be astonishing if I got a $10 set with real leather. That would be fantastic. And then it just rolls up into this little fancy, like case and you tie it and you're good to go. So now here comes the fun part. If you like this video, if you liked my review, please give it a like. Um, and I was actually thinking of doing a giveaway for a second one of these. I promise it's not going to be this one because I've used this one a lot and that would be kind of gross and nasty and, and nobody wants my face on theirs unless you really want it. I'm just kidding. but. Seriously, that would be kind of icky if you used my brushes and yuck. But if you are interested in a giveaway, please go ahead and comment below. And once I get enough people who say they want to, then I will go ahead and um, announce when I'm going to be doing the giveaway. Uh, I'm not going to buy this product if nobody's going to, you know, participate because then I'll have a lonely brush set all by itself just sitting there going womp womp. Yep. So, yeah, either go ahead and contact me on here under the comments below down in that area or you can go to my Facebook page and contact me there. It's facebook.com slash xx. It's just me, 2192xx. But like I said, I won't do the giveaway if there's not enough people, so go ahead and also tell your friends about it. They do, however, have to be subscribed to my channel. That is one of the main rules. And I will post a new video if I get enough people with the rest of the rules. And if you really, really like this video, like my review, go ahead and subscribe so you can be notified every time I put up a new video. And go ahead and go like my Facebook page, which I already told you the link. I can also be uh, found on Twitter, Instagram, and my blog. I will leave all those links in the description below for you, and yeah. So it is actually spring, and it's finally 67 degrees today, even though it's it's looking like it's going to rain. Oh well, that's weather in my area for you. 
So as always, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Be nice to each other and blah, blah, blah. Any motivational speech toward the end of this video. Bye.